17 million people worldwide suffer from eating disorders. 81% of all 9 to 10 year old girls are afraid of being fat. 51% of all 10 year old girls admit they will feel better about themselves if they are on a diet. And 90% of all people who suffer from eating disorders are women ages 15 to 25. Now, I would like to ask you, my audience, a question. Who around here feels 100% comfortable with their own body? Who around here absolutely likes the way they look? Just, just raise your hand if you do. Look, that's the spirit, people. But it should be everybody, right? Everybody should be able to feel comfortable with themselves. Now, I don't have the perfect body. I've got a little tummy, I've got stretch marks. I would like to show you, but I would probably be taken off stage. And the question I ask myself is, why? Why is it so hard for, for many of us to look into the mirror and actually like what we see? Well, I think I found the answer, and the answer is body image. What is body image, you ask? Well, that's the way you see yourself and how you imagine you look. Because in today's society, your appearance is more important than anything else, of course. I mean, women, is it working? No, it's not. Now it is. Women, they should be skinny, have big boobs, and they are expected to dress sexy in order to be attractive for men. And men, they should be like, have a six pack, huge bulging muscles, a sharp jawline, and make the women all go crazy about him. Because, well, heaven forbid if you are fat, the F word. Oh God, no, nobody wants to be fat, right? Because for some reason, fat equals being ugly. Why? I don't know. And that's why I believe that Imperfections do not exist. I think that if it wasn't for all those images you see every day, everywhere in the media, of you know, like people who are extremely attractive, but they are skinny, I think that if it wasn't for all those images you see every day, you wouldn't find yourself that unattractive. If you weren't told every day that this is ugly, would you still think you're unattractive? If you weren't told every day that there was something wrong with your body, would you still think you're ugly? Now, all I want to show you is another point of view. You don't have to change the way your body looks because your body is already perfect. I forgot what I was going to say. Um. Oh, right. Um, <laughs> I think what we need in this world is body positivity. Instead of bringing others down, try to give each other a compliment. If you see someone, you know, and they have nice hair, tell them it's not that difficult to create some kind of positivity. And maybe tomorrow morning, when you look in the mirror, you think of what I've told you. Thank you.